Skateboarding is often seen as a male-dominated sport, but some want to change that. KOIM's Ronnie Sarotsky explains how one man is getting young girls in Joplin more involved in the activity. Skateboarder Tom Walters always wanted to encourage his daughters to grow into the sport he loved. His oldest daughter grew up skateboarding with him, but when it came to heading to the skate park, she was outnumbered by all the boys. You know, there may be like two or three people the whole time she skated that, that were the same age or same uh, gender as her to be able to skate with, uh, to have any type of sense of community there. Now, with his younger daughters, he's seeing more girls at the park, but that they seem hesitant to practice in public. And I've seen a lot of girls that might even just come up here and sit for hours and be too afraid to come get, jump in and start learning. So, Walters started the Shred Sister Skate Camp at Ewart Park, where he hosts all-girl skate sessions and lessons to encourage young girls to give the activity a try. Hopefully these set, the, the skate sessions and the camp will just provide that like growth of community out here to where then the girls don't feel scared to come off the bench and come out here onto the skate park. Jara Davis says she loves skateboarding and that practicing in a space of mostly girls helped her feel less judged when it came to learning new skills. I think that like sometimes like other people will judge and make you feel bad and like you'll lose your confidence to skate. So I just think like having like more girls around you and not judging is helpful. I think it helped me a lot today. For newcomer Anna Corcoran, coming out to these camps has helped her feel more sure of herself. I have definitely recommend it to a lot of other girls since I'm very anxious about a lot of things and this has boosted my confidence a little more. In Joplin, Bronte Sorotsky, KOM News. The next skate camp will be Monday, June 14th and will run for the next six weeks.